Welcome back. We have uh, taken a walk down to the Honda Racing Thailand pit, and I'm joined here by uh, Nakarin Atirapuvapat and Piwa Atumios. Uh, Nakarin, of course, a uh, very well-known rider from his international experience in, uh, in Moto3, as well as, uh, as well as in this series. And uh, Pia Watt, one of the stars of the AP250 series. So, uh, Macarin, Chip, let's, uh, let's, let's begin with you. Uh, you started this, uh, this series uh, very strongly, um, had a little bit of bad luck in the first round, uh, but you've had a good season and you lie in third place in the championship. Um, what are your, uh, what are your uh, objectives for this coming round? Yeah, I'm really confident for this lead and uh, also I will keep 100% for, for this lead and my team and uh, I try to do the best for home list. Okay. So you're an experienced rider now. Can you tell us something about how you deal with the pressure of riding at uh, international level, this level? Um, do you have any techniques to manage the, the pressure, the stress? Yeah, I always thinking in positive way, and uh, we found some uh, some good feeling, and uh, I think. Uh, not nothing is worry. Okay, well that's good. So sorry, can I just go one mic now? Uh, so could you tell us something about the support that your uh, your team gives you, and uh, in terms of racing and machine preparation and expertise? Yeah, we getting better with the bike, less bike late, uh, and also. My team get some setting and develop the bike, and uh, I think in homelet we do 100 percent. And finally, what's your objective this weekend, Chip? Yeah, <laughs> I try full full power for Thai fan. All right. Well, we wish you the very best of luck. Thank you for uh, for talking talking to us. Uh, I'm just going to um, move around because we've got one mic at the moment. To excuse me. To uh, to talk to Piawat Patumios, uh, who of course is riding in uh, AP250. Uh, Piawat, you uh, you had two podiums this season. Tell us about your uh, strategies for getting to the front and finishing well in the race. Uh, every time I let, I away think to win, I can do it. Okay, and what would you say is the biggest challenge of racing in the AP250 category? Uh, I think um, my rider very really strong. So many riders, very strong. Okay, and um, and what kind of support do you get from your team? My team is always my big support. Uh, I want to thank my team Honda Racing Thailand, my sponsor, for support me. I will do my best in race. Thank you. All right, that's fantastic, Pia Wat. Uh, very best luck for this weekend and to uh, the whole of uh, Honda Racing Thailand. Thank you very much. Uh, we're gonna just move next door now to the next pit. This is pit number 13. So here we are, as you can see, this is the uh, EEST NGT, N NGT racing team. Um, and we have, um, okay. And so this has been a, a private, uh, private team that's been very welcome in the, uh, in the championship this year. And, uh, and so I'd like to ask, uh, ask you, um, Kondanai, Shannon, 
Sorry, Shannon. Shannon, Shannon uh, okay, Shannon. What do you think are uh, the uh, the big challenges in this race car category? Oh yeah, this is uh, the big challenge for me. This is uh, first time to join the Asia Low Racing Championship. Yes, so I'm very happy. This car I joined the uh, 600, so have many top of or Asia rider, and have uh, many rider join the uh, World Cup, and I think this is a uh, this chance to learn and improve myself, improve my skill. Yeah. And could you tell us something about the preparations you've been doing for the race this weekend? Yes, I really work hard for my body and training with the coach and I learn uh, uh, to the video for, for the race in race one at the Chang International Circuit. Yes, um, uh, I really work hard and everyday training to prepare to this race. Shannon, it's great to have you here. Good luck for, uh, for this weekend. Now let's have a word with your boss. <laughs> um, so you've got a new rider in this weekend. What do you think are the main challenges for him? Yes, uh, thank you very much. This, uh, for my rider, I think he can uh, fighting this loud. Because uh, uh, this this rider okay have a try many many this uh, homeless in Chang International Circuit. Yes. And uh, the the team has been uh, been working hard this year. What would you say you have learned from racing in ARRC this year? Yeah. Uh, okay. Very happy to come back to uh, ARC. Uh, this is my team, okay. This year, first time to join uh, uh, ACL Racing. Yeah, because uh, I want uh, my leader for training for uh, race for uh, next uh, for next year. This, uh, I think very strong. And how about on the technical preparation side? How, how has that been? Is it different to uh, to racing in a national series? Uh, okay, this uh, mechanic. Okay, working hard for set up for bike. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Last question, and then I'll let you go. <laughs> Uh, what are your? It's been great having uh, EST uh, in the in the paddock this season. What are your plans for next season? Uh, yeah, next year. Okay, I think this my team uh, plan have joy 1000 CC. Yes. Fantastic. We're looking forward to to that. Uh, very best of luck for this weekend. Shannon, all the best. Enjoy your first experience in uh, ARRC. Thank you very much. And thanks, everybody. Uh, stay with us because we, uh, as I said, we will be continuing our interviews and conversations throughout the day. Uh, we're going to take a short break now and uh, be back with some more people we can talk to. And remember, keep your questions and comments coming on YouTube and Facebook. We'll see you in a few minutes. Thank you very much, and good luck this weekend, yep. seriously. Yep.